hey folks, this is 7 here, welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to the Maple Farm. Indeed, awesome map this. So it is a fresh new day, September the 2nd. Not in real life, it's actually uh, March the 22nd, 2023. And a beautiful sunny day here on the Sunshine Coast of Powell River, Canada. Alright, as it is a new day, let's... Uh, have a check here, make sure everybody's got food. The cows are doing oakly doakly. They have straw, they're making the poopage. Okay. Still a little young to be popping the milk, but that's okay. We can live with that. The buck 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 bucks have food. I checked them earlier. The pigs are good as well. What's the matter, Dexter? Yes, I'm making a video, and no, you can't be in it. Alright, pigs are doing good. Don't have a ton of food, but they haven't gone through that much since yesterday. How's your egg income in there, ladies? Hmm? Hmm? I ask you. Yeah, yeah. Alright, coming along. You're making the eggs, that's all we can ask for. Do 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 do. What do we got going on here? Oh my goodness, Dexter, why are you being so weird? Like that's a question that could be answered, eh, buddy? Hmm. sugar beets. <clears throat> I want to uh, head down and have a look at some of our fields. So, you want to pop along, come for a ride? Here we go. He's such a funny boy. Will you stop? Oh, you know, I'm going to get rid of this thing just because of the brakes at some point. Seriously, you can't stop. I put the brakes on here. Yeah, full. This is where we stopped. I don't know, man. For something that's mostly wheels, got no weight to it. It's not like it's carrying a lot. That's only, you know couple thousand liters. Ooh, looks like our gate has pushed out onto the road slightly. No, oh, well, I guess they'll just have to put up with it, won't they? Alright, let's go. We'll uh, drop these off. Have it pounded into sugar. But yeah, full brakes again, and nothing happens. My God. All right, so we've got this field. Uh, yeah, it's completely empty. It's a pretty good sized field, eh? Hmm. All right, we should come in and give it a spray. Then we can give it a plow. Here's what I'm concerned with. And it's still growing, okay. So not ready for harvest dating yet. <clears throat> now we know all the fields down here are good. Alright, so... this one across the road. This is... It was wheat. Again, a fair-sized field. Full of weeds. 
Um, yeah, I think we'll give this a spray and a plow. Indeed. And I've still got some gear to take home by the looks of things. Um, that's it, right? Our fields don't go any further down. I believe that's as far as they go. This is a big field. Okay, yeah, that's all we own on this side of the road. So, I say that's worth a spray and a plow. Oh, look. Sugar, 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 sugar. Nice. We've got sugar, and that can go over to the dairy, which is uh, next door. How heavy are these cartons of sugar? They're way too heavy for me. Um, you're just being ridiculous now, Dexter. Stop it. I'm serious. You're being some kind of a weirdo. That's quite the jump, isn't it? Uh, yeah, I'm not going to bother with those for the moment. We have other fish to fry. So, let's head back to the farm and uh, grab a frying pan. <clears throat> Alright, so a couple of fields that could use it. Actually, well no, it's not that small, is it? That's fine. That's fine. We might even plant that one up. Throw some more cannoli in it. Because we do have this oil plant here. And I don't really want to be feeding it our sunflowers. In case we need those for the pegas. Oop. Okay. There we go. Now, yes indeed, um, we'll start you up, and uh, I want to make sure that you will do what I need you to do. Get him to follow us home. <clears throat> and we'll top up our tank. And then we're going to go down and spray those two fields. There we go. Have them follow us to there. Awesome. Thanks, man. And you're out of here. Okay. Yeah, let's lower that down. There we go. Now, you, going for the big stuff. But you're not going there, you're going here. If, ooh, I don't know if this will fit. Okay, no it won't. We're going to have to go around. Oh, come on, buddy. Yeah, having a hard time with that turning radius, aren't you? That's okay. We'll fit out this gate. Yes. 
Oh, freaking traffic, man. Fine. Go, 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 go. Ugh. Don't stop here. Look at num nums, man. It's like they've never seen a tractor before. Okay. can sit there, because that's going to be your first job. Ba, 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 ba. Now, we used it all, didn't we? Yes, we did. How much you got left? Yeah, and as much as I'd like. Well, we're not exactly rich, but we do need another one. So, oops, this is what I meant to pick. You, and you... Uh, yeah, that is, uh, liquid fertilizer, good. Yes, okay. Now, one thing I did want to do, let's have a look-ski here. There we go. How do I move my shop thing? I forgot which, uh, which is no surprise, I mean... If WASD wasn't used so much, I'd probably forget how to walk most of the time, but there you go. Uh, front loaders, cranes, placeables, camera, game, gearbox, lights, radio expansion, seat, reset, bail counter, open bank management, Da, 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 da. Follow me, field service, guidance steering, interactive. <coughs> hmm. Okay, I've missed it apparently. Dang it. Um. Ah, oh boy, that figures. Tracking chat. Oh well, okay. I'll have to go and have a look at the mod, I guess, because yeah, I don't, uh, I don't remember. But I want to move it out into, uh, well, not into the field, but in that sort of general direction there, off to the side, where it's not going to interfere so much with things. There you are. Bloody expensive. Nine cents worth of chemicals. $3,200 a bottle. <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's fun. Let's go. Uh, it's uh, kind of a drag. I screwed up the road there. Oh well. There's not much we can do. Uh, I 
think I just missed the entrance. Yoing. Sugar. Nice. Ha <laughs> ha, you missed. Um, oh. God, I should have washed this thing. Oh well. We'll do what we can. Definitely spraying. So let's get a bit of a headland. Not easy to see the spray on this field, but it is doable. Okay. Big shout out to the uh, to Cavalier Roy, the maker of the map. Appreciate you stopping by and checking out how badly I'm uh, destroying your hard work. <laughs> so, and uh, yeah, I hope you didn't take offense by the comments about the uh, uneven sheds and stuff. Like I said, like I uh, told you in the reply, man, it's just not something you would see here in Canada. Um, you know, we don't live on a, a tiny island where every scrap of, uh, scrap of space is important. In fact, we've got more deserted land in this country than uh, all of the living space in Europe, so. Yeah, like just unoccupied, you know, we're the second largest country in the world and we're sort of three quarters of it's empty. <laughs> so, yeah. I don't think, uh, I don't think building contractors here, if they were going to build a shed and the land wasn't even, they wouldn't know what the heck to do. You know, none of their equipment would work. <laughs> so, yeah. But no, I can understand it, you know. You build where you can. And I would imagine there's a... Well, not imagine, I know. 
but there is a heck of a cost in currents if you have to uh, level an area the size of these farmyards you know plus you gotta bring material in and take material out and again when you live in a country that's so big that three quarters of it is empty yeah finding places to put things is not really an issue uh, I gotta pick one side or the other we're not gonna get both not for all of it anyway Ooh, pretty darn close though eh? yeah now we're missing both sides perfect you refolded no uh, was it the next one down possibly But other than that, yeah, I, uh, well, not even other than that, including that, I do really like the map. I think it's, uh, did an awesome job, made quite an interesting, uh, interesting little platform to play on. For sure. Alright, um, yeah, let's see what we can do with this puppy. Sip of coffee. Ah, right on. We progress from hot to lukewarm. <laughs> Which, of course, will be followed quickly by nasty cold. On you go. Feed the weeds. Uh, uh, uh. Bah, 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 bah. But when we plow it in, uh oh, tree. Ooh, we just missed that. Okay, I gotta get away from there. We're gonna get stuck. We don't want to be stuck. Stump? Nope. Yoink. So yeah, up next, of course, will come a bunch of plowing as we wait for our corn and the uh, last crop of sunflowers that we have in as well. <coughs> and then these fields will uh, do for the next round.
some little lots of spree. Lots and lots and lots. Okay. Excellent. Put all of that nitrogen the plant sucked out of the soil back in. Well, it's the theory anyway. There we go. Meh. <laughs> Just not the direction you want to be facing while you're driving, dude. It's nice to know who's following you, but yeah, it's in front of you might just pay off a little better. Okay. The heck is that symbol up there? Is that like don't read a book while you're driving or what? Right up there on the door pillar. We got the triangle with the caution sign. Well, exclamation point. But what is that underneath? Cover one eye when reading? Oh, read the re read the manual. I bet you that's what it's telling you. <laughs> I don't know. Ah, let's leave the gate open. I'm feeling in a let's shoot the trespassers mood. I mean, I wouldn't mind some company. So, uh, yeah. Well, let's uh, go place the spray. Excellent. Okay. Now, as I just can't see out the freaking windows anymore, let's waddle on over here. Do a quick scrub on the tractor, shall we? Do 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 do. Cleaned off. Nice. Let's get right in here and get all the spinny bits going. Nice. Let's get that glass clean. Alright. So. No, oh, okay. Well. Okay, apparently we put it back. Weird, I don't remember putting it back. <laughs> okay. Nice. something I wanted to check here before I get on with the happy prospect of the big plow and I guess this guy will do I want to figure out how to get grass out of this thing so I mean, it shows it right here. Ooh. Hey, silage, wood chips, grass. Oh. Well, that was difficult. Now, big question. See, it doesn't list it here. But... 
on the uh, the main page where you look at your animals it says they have no grass but it does count for a portion of their feed so oh right away there we go problem solved them cows them cows them lovely cows well, that's all you're taking uh oh. Well, that's not great news, girls. Hmm. Yeah, I don't get it. Oh, I do now. We're full. So it would take more grass, but we've got a little too much hay in there at the moment. So, yeah. Okay. Well, eat your hay. And there's uh, fresh grass here. Whenever you're ready. Ah, that could be an issue. Yeah. Um, I can't dump it back out. <laughs> um. Not a big deal. I mean, that's certainly not ideal, you know, but, like I said, it's not, uh, not that big a deal. Let's just park you here. Okay. So, here we go. Yes. Boop, 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 doo -doo -doo. As you can see that plow from over the horizon. Alright. What does it say? No, oh, not much. Meet you back here. So it's not a fast process, but it covers a lot of ground, so. There's that. <laughs> that with direct seeding I shouldn't need to plow but I would like to uh, I would like to ensure that we are putting these nutrients back into the soil so that's what this is all about Fat headland, but joint nice.
a bit uh, a bit too sharp a corner to just turn through I'm afraid unless we want to end up eating a whole lot of hedgy okay that should do this one's okay it's a much shallower outside sort of corner to deal with so burgle burgle there we go I know it's Argle Bargle, but you know. <clears throat> what do we got going on here? This looks like a whole bunch of uh, crappy goodness. Let's have a look. What do you got, man? Ooh, sore gum. <laughs> yeah. I just wanted to find out. It's not our field or anything, and I don't want another field. But, like I said. Just thought I'd check. That looks so uh, good and healthy. It's saying it's going to get a pretty low yield, like less than 60%. But I'm hoping we do much better on these fields that we're, you know, bothering to prep. Because these are going to be, uh, as I say, next year's fields. The spring planting, we already have a reasonable amount. Uh, can I squeeze past that? Kind of, eh? Sure. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, we've got some... Uh, overwinter crops in now. So that's not a worry. Like I say, this is just prep for next season. Okay, here we are. Back at the start line. So. Boom. Nice. Very, very nice. No, I'm just gonna clean up this edge a bit. No, apparently it won't. There you go. Okay. Okay. I'll argue with that. So I think we'll get to this end and then we'll see if we can't uh, hire up a fella or a girl. I mean, I'm not, uh, I'm not fussy. They both seem more than capable. So 
Let's get the rest of this done while we have a wee opportunity. Alright, what do I got? I've got grass, eh? Um, have I got two bales down or just one? Two. Good stuff. So I can pop these on top. Let's grab the top three. Now I gotta be careful because this is supposed to be two wide and it's only one wide. So I don't want to go right through. Logger's trick. <laughs> okay. Now, whoop. See, this thing's great for handling normal bales, but man, when I hit it with silage bales with that other clamp thing, yeah, it was obvious, but uh, it needed a little work. There you go. Whoop. <laughs> that wouldn't have gone well. it all. Well, not all. We'll put you here. Good. Okay. Well, you are, uh, oh, there's a messy looking pile, eh? Especially that last bale. What a winner. <laughs> Come on, you little fart. Alright, 
top three. For a start. Level. A bit off there. There we go. Pop. Nice. Okay. Get you moved over to the hay section of our shed here. Nice and snug. Oop. Okay. Yeah, see, this is a great device. Just, yeah. No good for silage bales unless you don't mind poking holes. Almost time to cut the grass again by now. <laughs> Alright, is he, uh, no, he's not getting hung up on the hedge, at least not yet. But I'd kind of like to get over there because I think that's about where he is. So, let's get you kind of where we want you. Nice. Whoop. that. Yes. Not bad. A little bit of scruff left. Okay. Just here. leaving these little weirdness marks, but it's okay. Alright. How'd you do on the other end? Everything here looks good. Did you have any of the same issues? Yeah, you did. Okay. No biggie, we'll fix it. There we go, down you get. So now we gotta hope 
hoping that we can get this all the way down to the other farm without being uh, overwhelmed by the amount of lunatics in the other lane because this doesn't exactly fit that well on these narrow country roads. At least it doesn't fit that well without hitting things. So, yeah. But, it's worth it because it gets the job done in a really nice amount of time, i.e. short. So, we just have to hope Oh, God. <laughs> oh, come on. Don't. Yeah, just a complete... garble of traffic. Alright, here's our first... first bit of work. There we go. Nice. But that, my friends, is going to wait for next episode. So, hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button. really helps out. And, uh, well, you know, I could use all the help I could get. So, take care of each other, folks. And ciao. For now.